So these are our new Atlas Energy 12Ks. Um, we're gonna go ahead and test our system. We're gonna simulate the grid going down. You ready, Greg? Yes. So right now they're that's the solar coming in, and they're pushing to the grid. You ready? Ready. There we go. Grid shut off. ATS is flopped. Now we are on battery power. 2,000 watts on the load. The battery is taking up the system. Um, the way we have this set up, we've got one 12K and she's got four 10 kilowatt Atlas batteries. Um, so right now, her solar edge, which is AC coupled, should turn on in 10 or 15 minutes. Um, right now, the battery is just going to take up the loads until that happens. But what we did with a lot of these um, systems we've been installing, if, you, if you're trying to AC couple and you also want a whole home generator backup system, what we did was we installed a 100 amp transfer switch because the generators only output 100. But um, we installed these two ATSs. They... Um, She's got basically 100 amp and 150 amp service for upstairs and downstairs in her house. That's why there's two ATSs. Um, but then we installed the third ATS. So for if for whatever reason the bat or the inverter hits the uh, the shutoff voltage, stops power to the loads, it'll send the two wire start to the generator. Third ATS will flop, and now you got generator power coming in and. Um, as well as having the AC coupled feature of either micro inverters. In this case, we got the solar edge device. Um, so we did that. It's good. Well, so yeah, that's our that's our new 12K Lux um, inverters, and the system works good. So we love it.